This Jesus that we're talking about tonight, he ain't asking you to do a daggone thing that he ain't done himself. Here he is. Don't you realize that, like, everything he asked of us, he came and did himself. He was tempted in every way, yet without sin. Just like we are. Like, we can't say we got it harder or rougher than Jesus had it because he got tempted in every way. Except he rose to the occasion he did not sin. He fulfilled that law. Met every statue. Crossed every T dot at every I. Feel me? Now watch. I'm telling you, you're going to have to give birth to something. Like a Nicodemus. Like, flesh gives birth to flesh, but spirit gives birth to spirit. You're going to have to cry out. You're going to have to um, lose that dignity. You have to come before Jesus and let him deliver you. Like, just get it out of me. And that's what happened to Jesus. He ain't asking you to do nothing he ain't done, right? Let me show you. I'm going to finish you with this. Mark 15. Baby, this is beautiful. Beautiful. Now watch this. You're going to see how it ended for Jesus and what he did in it. Mark 15, 33. At noon, darkness came over the whole land until 3 in the afternoon. And at 3 in the afternoon, Jesus cried out in a loud voice, My God, my God, why have you forsaken me? When some of those standing near heard this, they said, listen, he's calling Elijah. Someone ran, filled a sponge with wine vinegar, put it on a staff, and offered Jesus to drink. Now leave him alone. Let's see if Elijah comes to take him down, he said. Now watch this, baby. With a loud cry, Jesus breathed his last. Ah, Do you see this? With a loud cry, Jesus breathed his last. I'm sorry. You thought he went peacefully, right? You thought he went with dignity. You thought he went with, like, um, this aura of uh, righteousness, right? Ah, that's the furthest thing from the truth. I know we've got it looking good in picture books. Listen to me. Jesus had no dignity on that cross. He hung in, like, um, he was beat down. He was humiliated. He stripped down naked as a jaybird on that cross. Ain't no little shawl over him like you see in the the depictions and the carvings. Like that man was exposed for the whole world to see. And what's he do while he's up there? Cries out with the last breath. Just get it out of me. More stately, he says, it is finished. I just gave birth to a way for them. I just gave birth to something ain't the world never seen before. A way back for my um, brothers and sisters to come to their father like that's what he's doing here he crying out with no dignity with no shame he said i don't care what you see i don't care what you think i don't care what you hear it's time to make something new that ain't never been made before a way for your sins to be forgiven and he cried out his last and what he do he opened a new way for us watch this the curtain on the temple was torn in two from top to bottom. Like that, tell me some tearing don't happen in some daggone deliveries. And when the centurion who stood there in front of Jesus saw how he died, he said, surely this man was the son of God. Like as soon as he did it, boom! First recorded testimony of a, like a, tra- uh, a man accepting Christ. Like, Surely this man was the son of God. How did that just happen? He just birthed a new way for him to be saved. By faith and faith alone. 